think you should know me, right? I'm not half a replica. What is going on everybody? I hope everyone's having an amazing day. It's set back at it with another video for you guys today. Um, to be honest, I didn't really have a lot to film for this video, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick market update. Um, I couldn't really think of any ideas, to be honest. The NFT space has been thriving lately, and I want to give you guys some uh, market updates as well as some cryptocurrency updates for the NFT and crypto space. Um, but without further ado, make sure you guys like and subscribe and comment down below which, which you guys are buying right now in the NFT space. And let's jump right into the video. So looking at OpenSea volume, we've actually had seen a last a really big change since I last did a market update. Um, we did hit about 100 million here on the 24th, and then yesterday, uh, March 27th, we did uh, hit 112 million dollars, and today we're still sitting at about 48 million. Um, yesterday was a really good day, uh, you know, compared to all these days down here. Um, I'm seeing like a more of a bullish momentum now that. Um, we broke through and I think we're more of in a bullish market I could say I'm not 100% on that just because for me um, a bullish uh, market is if the market volume for every day hits about 100 million which you haven't been hitting super consistently but we've been getting really close um, so that is the NFT daily uh, OpenSea daily volume um, pretty crazy and then look into like OpenSea itself in the last 24 hours um, the top projects for Ethereum, like the Bored Apes are still sitting pretty high at 106. Um, projects like Azuki, newer projects doing good. So um, we're still seeing an uptrend for the most part. A lot of reds, honestly, for the last 24 hours in the last week, there has been a lot of projects that have been doing pretty good. Um, I don't know really what stage we are in terms of the NFT like market in terms of the projects. Like I'm seeing a lot of projects do good right off the bat when they release, but like older blue chips have been going up slowly and coming down, like going up slowly, coming down. It's been a really weird um, cycle so far in 2022 just because of the war. Um, I feel like it's affecting everything, like all markets, crypto stocks, NFTs, so on and so forth. So we'll see what happens, um, but definitely some bullish momentum so far um, in the end of March here. Looking at... Um, the cryptocurrency market so we have hit an all-time not an all-time high sorry we've had have hit a pretty good high here about 48 million today um i just swear it was like at 47 earlier so we are going up on btc right now um last 24 hours as you guys can see seven percent same with ethereum ethereum has actually been thriving just following bitcoin about 34 grand and this is something that a lot of crypto investors and crypto enthusiasts will always tell you is that the whole market um it, as fortunate as it is you know we wish that every coin can kind of do its thing but as unfortunate as it sounds ethereum i mean bitcoin controls the whole market so if bitcoin goes up usually usually not always the rest of the market does follow um and we can see that with the top two coins they've always you know corresponding like both up seven percent in the last week both up 17 percent so um that's where we're at all the other coins you know the lower cap coins are still doing really good like in the last week 29 percent 10 percent 21 so so on and so forth um the weird thing about this current cycle we're in is that bitcoin is up a significant amount and nfts are still doing pretty good like you know hitting 112 in early march you hit 114 132 so it's a little bit weird um i honestly don't know why just probably because IRL stuff to be honest like with the war and everything like that surrounding that and news so we'll see what happens we'll see where everything goes but um, I'm not a financial advisor but definitely right now is probably a bad time to buy into crypto um, if you don't have any already just because I feel like it's not too late to get in but a lot of coins already had the run up the small cap coins from what i've seen and i don't think see them doing really really good one i have seen um do good that still might go up is shibu inu so shibu inu has had a massive recovery since i don't know when like it's been down for so long and it's recently went up with everything else so that one that's one i'm keeping on my eye out on um i feel like it has to do with elon musk but other than that, make sure you guys do follow me on Twitter at SentBTWE. Um, I did recently buy my ENS, so that's why I put my name as that. <laughs> uh, but I'm constantly in giveaways, um, bringing you guys alpha projects very new. Like this project, I literally followed this project here, Lo-Fi Originals. I think I mentioned them on the channel. I followed them when they had like, I want to say 400 followers, like really, really early. And now they're at, you know, 51K. So 
definitely tune into my Twitter. I'm in a lot of lot of giveaways, and I also bring you guys products pretty early, so why not? Um, help me reach 300 followers. I am at 280 right now, so it'd be definitely nice to hit 300 and keep going up from there. But without further ado, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Um, stay safe and tune in for my next video. I'm going to actually have some better content for you guys, um, jam-packed with new projects and everything like that. And I'm out. Peace. Bitch, I'm not gonna feel like I walk on water I'm talking to your bitch, did he lock up my toilet? Walk with the block,